If you're anything like me and the clients that I work with, I'm sure you'd love to find the fountain of youth. I mean, who wouldn't love to rewind the clock to be able to look and feel like we are still in our 20s or even better? Let's be serious. There's no magic pill, tip, trick or supplement or medication or treatment that's really going to be able to put your aging body into a DeLorean and back in time. So why do we see and hear of so many celebrities like actors and athletes and famous entrepreneurs who are seemingly able to roll back the clock and look like they're completely timeless. I'm Dr. J. I'm founder of evokelife.co in Vancouver, Canada. For almost two decades, I've been working with busy professionals, actors, stunt artists, musicians, and entrepreneurs to get the most out of their brains and their bodies, extending their health span, their lifespan and longevity with anti-aging solutions. And here's the secret. Treatment plans that are based on their unique physiology and genetics are the key to understanding what works for individual people People rather than what might work for the general population. So no, it's not that they're insanely rich or that they've had multiple plastic surgeries to cover up their blemishes or liposuction to get rid of that dad bod, to tighten that tummy or to mold those triceps. Okay, maybe they've done some of that too. The secret is that they've learned to prioritize and to optimize their health and their wellness based on their unique DNA. They figured out what tools and what diets, what types of exercise, what types of foods are best for them. And those things are different for each of us. They know what supplements are gonna have the greatest impact on their body. They've got a literal blueprint for how their brain and body are built to function at their absolute best. It's like having an instruction manual for how to get the most out of themselves, how to be the most superhuman version of themselves. Wouldn't it be nice to have the trust and clarity that the recommendations that you're getting from your doctor are built for you right down from the DNA level rather than a best guess an average of the general population. You are a unique and an individual person and your healthcare and your recommendations for optimizing your health span need to be individualized to you and your context and your DNA as well. If you're listening to me or sitting here watching this video, I strongly doubt that you are willing to settle for being just average. And I'm willing to bet that if you could clear that brain fog, regain that energy and that level of motivation again and boost that energy, I think you'll, you'll feel like you could do a lot more than you're actually doing right now and a better version of yourself for those people around you. Our conventional medical system, for better and for worse, is designed to treat sick people. The system's not designed to prevent people from getting sick. It's certainly not designed to help keep people healthy or to optimize their health. So I think with the rich and the famous and the smartest business people out there and the greatest creatives on the planet, all these people are doing these things that the rest of us, for the most part, aren't doing. And that is leveraging functional genetics and functional genetic data and using advanced blood tests to really assess and literally build a roadmap to success for their brains and their bodies. This combination of functional genetics with comprehensive blood work is becoming known as precision medicine. With precision medicine, what we get from this roadmap is clarity as to what kinds of fuels do we need to put into our body? What kind of quantities and what kinds of ratios of those macronutrients do we need to be applying in our diet? It explains how our brains and our bodies are built to react to stress and under duress. It informs us for how we should be exercising to get the most out of our bodies and to accomplish the kinds of goals that we want to achieve with our bodies so we can look and feel the way that we want to. It sheds lights on what kinds of supplements and what kind of medications are going to be most effective for us, where there's the greatest leverage, and where there may be side effects or negative effects for these kinds of tools so that we can know in advance what's going to work for us, what are we going to feel great on, and what are the things that are not going to be as applicable or as appropriate for each of us as individual people. What precision medicine provides us with is an opportunity to completely demystify all of the different biohacks and the different kinds of tips and tricks and BS that you might find on the internet. Like, is intermittent fasting really good for me if I want to lose fat or if I want to gain muscle? Is Ozempic the right tool for me to be using in order to lose fat and to gain muscle mass? Or is Ozempic going to make me lose more muscle mass? Is cold plunging actually a good idea for me? Is it actually going to improve my immune system? Is NAD the best-selling supplement for a reason out there? Or is that a completely new fad that's going to be gone again in 10 weeks? Are there more cost-effective supplements out there that can help with anti-aging and for extending longevity and lifespan? Is curcumin really a safe alternative for anti-inflammation and pain management? Or is it more dangerous to use curcumin in combination with some of the drugs that you might already be using or some of the supplements for that matter? And hey, if curcumin is something that you want to learn more about, check out my other videos because I talk all about how curcumin can actually downregulate one of the most important detoxification enzymes in your body. If having this kind of instruction manual for your body is something that makes sense to you, there are three components to an effective 
precision medicine program that are gonna help you to optimize health span and longevity that you absolutely need to be mindful of. Number one, you need to establish a baseline set of comprehensive blood work that investigates your health, not just from a preventive or a reactive state, but from a proactive perspective. We want to know about what are some of the things that you want to achieve in the future and make sure that the blood work that we have gives us a baseline for understanding how we can move forward from that. It gives us a reference point to refer back to in the future so we can track what you're doing on an ongoing basis and how successful the kinds of treatments or recommendations are that we're giving you. Unfortunately, in Canada, our public healthcare system doesn't want to spend the money on this preventive or proactive medicine. And so a lot of the kinds of blood work that we want to get on a precision medicine program are not typically going to be covered by public health. And a lot of this blood work will have to be accessed fee for service or through private care. What's even more disappointing is that a lot of conventional medical doctors and family doctors might not even be aware of the usefulness of some of these tools and these comprehensive blood tests that are available for us. Number two, get a functional genetic assessment done. The test that I use in my practice looks at over 130 different markers that are evidence-based and that we have scientific data for that look at these SNPs or single nucleotide polymorphisms in your DNA. Across these 90 different genes that we look at, we can really understand how your brain and your body are built to function at their best. These 90 genes make up a blueprint for how your brain and body are built to function at their best. They really define how your body and how your brain is designed to interact with our environment, how they interact with stress, what kinds of foods that might be the most leverageable for you, where there are supplements and medications that are going to be most effective for you, and understanding how those tools like drugs and pharmaceuticals as well as supplements may interact with each other. Do not get ripped off by paying for just five of those methylation genes that everybody's talking about right now, there are literally over 130 to 140 different SNPs right now that we are looking at in functional medicine that are just as important to consider in combination with those MTHFR genes and methylation issues. Number three, you need a coach. Someone who can help you analyze and interpret that data and then bring it into a practical set of recommendations for what you can execute on a daily basis. This isn't just about creating the perfect treatment plan because I could create the most perfect treatment plan for you that's guaranteed to work, but if you're not able to execute that, if you're not able to sustain that on an ongoing basis and stack habits on that, then it's going to be a useless treatment plan and you're going to fall off the wagon. It won't be successful. So what you need is a coach. Someone who can read between the lines of your genetic data and put together all those pieces into a veritable puzzle that helps you understand where the greatest leverage points are going to be and what the priorities are for you to attack right away. Someone who has the training to integrate all of this data into one holistic picture, and then the training not to tell you what to do, but to work with you in a partnership to really help you understand why these things are important, why one thing might be more important than the other, and where to put more time and effort and money in some cases into the level of effort that you're putting into your treatment plan. What are you willing and capable of doing on a daily basis? What can you afford the time and the money to do? What are the lowest hanging fruits? What are the most impactful opportunities for you? How can you keep yourself accountable and motivated to continue doing these treatments? You don't just need a doctor or a set of tests. You need a partner to work with as you move forward through these recommendations as you build a plan towards optimizing your health span. Coach Christopher Summer once said, you're not responsible for the hand of cards that you were dealt, you're responsible for maxing out what you were given. So how do we do that? Well, number one, we get comprehensive blood work done. Number two, we get a functional genetic assessment. And number three, we get a coach who can help you analyze, interpret, and bring those recommendations to life in a pragmatic way that makes sense for the context of your life. Bottom line, if you're sick and tired of feeling sick and tired, and you're ready to unleash that energy that's been lost to you, we already live in a day and age where we can take our genetic information and comprehensive blood work that's readily accessible to us and put it together in a personalized precision medicine program that's based right down from your DNA. Hey, who else do you know that needs to hear this kind of thing? Do them a favor and share this link to this video. And of course, if you have any questions, fire them into the comment below. I'm always here to answer them for you. If functional genetics, personalized medicine, and advanced proactive blood works are things that you're really interested in, make sure you hit that subscribe button and click the bell so that you can get notified of the new videos that I'll be coming out with in a very short time. Lastly, be sure to check out my videos, why the normal range for B12 is stupid and why curcumin is really dangerous.